humans love the power of a horse. What was forged by nature has become our passion. Ireland has a deep love affair with the horse. In the land of the horse, you can see all around you that bond between human and animal that goes back thousands of years. This pleasure in horses is one of the world's most enduring and enchanting of all pastimes. And the great skill to breed the best horses is as precious as it ever was in history. Every new foal brings with it a unique genetic legacy. A journey across vast geography, reaching back to prehistoric times. Thirty thousand years ago, humans crept into the darkness of caves and painted their world. Here are the beasts they feared. And among them, a creature that caught the eye for its speed as it raced across the plains. Many thousands of years would pass before humans took another step towards the horse. When two natures entwined forever. This new relationship with the horse brought power and with it wealth. Horsemanship was knowledge more precious than gold and was carefully passed to each new generation. For centuries, breeders have relied on that same highly skilled horsemanship to judge the next generation of champions. But today, a new kind of knowledge is beginning to emerge about the potential of a horse. Dr. Emmeline Hill leads a team of scientists at University College Dublin. She investigates the genetics of racing performance in the thoroughbred. All the horses that we work with run fast. Some just run faster than others, and that's always been the big question. What is it genetically about them that makes some of them run faster? Dawn Approach is a champion racehorse, one of the world's best. Through the stud book, we can trace his bloodline back over 300 years. Back then, the fates of nations ebbed and flowed on horseback. The Bayali Turk was famously captured in the Turkish war. Now his genes thrill millions on the world's racecourses. And from time to time, a horse like Dawn Approach stands above the others and reveals that rich history in his blood. He has come to meet his challengers at Newmarket's 2,000 guineas. He enters the stall as the highest ranked horse in the world, winning every race of his career so far. His owner and his trainer are confident he can do it again. But this is his biggest test. Seven from seven. 
seven wins from seven races. What is it that made him a champion? People love to watch horses race. The power and the speed of the horse is thrilling and people have been doing it for centuries. What I most like to do is to look inside a horse and try to understand what makes a great horse really great. Dr. Hill needed to find a partnership in the world of elite horse racing. She found a great ally in Jim Bulger, one of Ireland's top trainers, one of the world's best. For the last 10 years, her team has had the opportunity to study some of the world's best racehorses. Early in the work, they made a groundbreaking discovery. Taking hundreds of blood samples from horses racing at the highest level all over the world, they examined the genetic code for a particular muscle gene, the myostatin gene. And they found that a tiny single difference at that gene could determine the best racing distance for a horse. They called it the speed gene. It was the world's first discovery linking a single gene with a profound effect on racing performance. Finding this link was a real eureka moment. It was something that breeders had been selecting for for centuries, and there, in the DNA, we could actually see the difference. A single, simple, natural indicator of speed. At a mile and under, Dawn Approach has excelled. And in fact, his speed gene test reveals the optimum code for sprint distances. The speed gene is only the beginning of this new chapter in our relationship with the horse. Scientists will go on to find many fascinating pieces of the jigsaw in the horse genome that breeders have been trying to unlock for thousands of years. Every new foal carries a genetic history. What we're now trying to do is to understand the parts of that DNA that enable it to be a future champion.